This year, for the first time, the Academy is giving an award for the best achievement in costume design. It would be foolish to elaborate on the importance of costume to a picture. We all know how very much it helps. Generally, of course, it's more in the province of actresses and actors. With the exception of period pieces, we men are very often given that show up Monday in a blue suit routine. And so it is fitting that an actress will present the award for costume design. This young miss is one who started among us and became a star at a time when she wouldn't have been allowed to stay up this late. She has since matured. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Elizabeth Taylor. <laughs> For the best achievement in costume design of a black and white production, B.F.'s daughter, Metro Golden Mare, costumes by Irene. Hamlet, J. Arthur Rank, Two Cities film, Universal International, British. Costumes by Roger K. First. Roger K. First for Hamlet, J. Arthur Rank, Two Cities film, Universal International. <laughs> Gordon accepted the award for the winner. For the best achievement in costume design of a color production, The Emperor Waltz, Paramount. Costumes by Edith Head and Guile Steele. Joan of Arc, Sierra Pictures, RKO. Costumes by Dorothy Jeekins and Karinska. Dorothy Jeekins and Karinska for Joan of Arc. <laughs> Thank you very much, Elizabeth Taylor. <laughs> 